Hello friends, in this video I'll tell you 5 signs whether your computer is good or bad. So let's get started. And once you're done with this video, your system will be way faster, way secure and safe and it should not have any kind of bugs or junks in the machine. So the very first sign if your computer is good when you turn on or restart the machine the startup time is lesser in many of the cases I find when they reboot or, or when they restart the machine turn on the machine it takes a lot of time to turn on which is really bad so in order to fix that we just need to press window and R or just do a right click on the start icon and go to task manager and here we need to go to startup item in the status section you can simply enable or disable you can sort it out now once you sort all enables at the top look all unwanted applications at the startup because these are the applications which actually takes a lot of time when you boot up the machine so your system gets huge load while turning on so make sure from here you disable all unwanted applications now when you disable those unwanted application that doesn't mean you cannot use it you can use it whenever you would like to you just have to double click or open that application it will let you open it just it will not uh, turn on without your permission so we can do that the second thing is the disk usage if your computer is good the CPU usage will be always lesser than 30 percent or 20 percent if you're not doing anything so currently I'm not doing anything I have a i7 10th generation processor and I'm not doing anything currently it's just the screen recording thing is going on and still I have the CPU usage 10 percent in many uh, cases I have find CPU usage is more than 60 or 70 percent which is really bad for the hard drive really bad for the whole machine so in order to fix that you make sure all the unwanted process or applications are not running from here you can see which all applications are active so if you see any application close that and in the startup as I told you you can disable all those unwanted and restart the machine and see the CPU usage is less or not so this is a very important thing because if your system keep on using the whole whole course of CPU it may get damaged very soon because it may get heated right now the third thing is the DNS resolution now you guys say what is DNS resolution so whenever we open any Google Chrome or any browser edge browser and if I type anything like msn.com it takes time to resolve it it takes time to load it that's a sign when we have some infection or any kind of redirection any kind of junk sitting lot of sit lot of cache in the computer for that what I would recommend to change the DLS DNS resolution and for that you can press window in R and type ncpa.cpl and then hit OK once you do that you will see your connected connection so just do a right click on the adapter which you're using go to properties and then go to IPv4 properties and here you can type 8 then use the right arrow key then type again 8 use arrow key right arrow key and 8 and here 8 8 4 4 once you do that just click on OK and you are good to go and check is it loading faster or not one more thing which you can do from here by just clicking on these three dots and go to settings and scroll it down and here you can clear browsing data and third-party cookies and all so by click clearing the browsing data like cookies and all from all time it will 
make the uh, Chrome browser faster so your overall experience while using the browser will be better than earlier alright the last thing which is the very common cause and I find almost in all machines which is the junk the bad registries the cache the temporary files so it makes the computer slow for that we just need to press window and R type clean MGR and then hit OK this is a magical thing the disk cleanup I must I recommend to everyone to do it so I'll just select each and everything make sure you don't have anything important in recycle bin because people do save things uh, or uh, trash you know in so make sure you don't have anything in recycle bin else it will not going to delete any kind of data folders pictures anything which you created it is only the junk which is created by the system so once you click on OK it will wipe it out all the things and your computer will be better than earlier you just need to restart and see the performance and hit the like button and subscribe have a wonderful day bye bye